Carrie Runyon here, visual artist and creative encourager, and welcome to Loosening Up Perfectly Imperfect Watercolor. In this class, I'm going to be sharing with you all my tips and tricks with watercolor, as well as my philosophy on watercolor and art in general. I come from a background of being extremely tight with my art. I'm gonna show you something I did in college here. That old lady was all done in watercolor with a little bit of gouache brought in for her veil on her head, and it was very tight. It took me forever and as a person who wanted to do illustration for a living I knew that something was gonna have to give as far as the amount of time I was putting in on one piece. So as I went along with my career, which I've been in for now 40-ish years, I learned a lot about watercolor and I learned a lot about how to let go of all the need to be tight and perfect with my paintings. So that's what I hope to share with you here. This class is perfect for those of you who want to loosen up your watercolor. I'll also be bringing in some India ink and perhaps some watercolor pencils to add. Also, I might be using a little bit of white pen or gouache to add some details. So all of this is perfectly imperfect. I'm not a purist when it comes to watercolor, but not being a purist is part of that perfectly imperfect way of creating. We'll be working on a couple different projects in this class. One will be, of course, painting cats and loosening up there. The other one will be a little bit about flowers because I'm working on a bunch of flowers lately and I thought that would be fun to share for those of you who may not like cats, which is crazy. Speaking of cats, Tucker may join me during this process. We'll see. He doesn't always cooperate, but Sometimes he shows up and helps me with my paintings. Cat hair. So that's a little bit about this class. I'm so glad you're here. So let's jump in.